Good morning. So uniting the free thinkers. I think it's a good idea. I think this is what's going on. I know this is going on right now. Right. Now this video will be on YouTube. Please remember this when you hear me talking. Right. So I have one story from Boston. It's amazing, I think. And another one from Norway. Right. So there was a big protest in Boston and they were protesting what? Yeah, the, the passports and the mandates. Why? Don't you like it? Yeah. You're talking about freedom and stuff. Yeah. And then Antifa showed up, attacking the protesters. And apparently Antifa said, if you protest, if you oppose the government mandates, you are a fascist. Yeah. And you might think this is strange. It's not strange at all. You see, uh, you have Joe Biden, this wonderful, powerful president of the United States. He had to make some very tough decisions lately. And he needs support or he will get sad. See? So I think it's just a nice gesture. So good job, Antifa, attacking these protesters wanting freedom, you know, it's pathetic, protesting, right, don't you listen to the health authorities, all right, uh, this story is from Norway, uh, I read it in a Norwegian newspaper, a uh, number of people dying in Norway has increased dramatically during the last three months, well that's weird, uh, what's going on? I think I know what some of you very bad people think. You think it's got something to do with the vaccine, don't you? You bad people. You should be ashamed of yourself. Yeah. Don't you listen to the health authorities. The vaccine is totally harmless. Uh, no. You should listen to them. And agree. Yeah. You know, I have a theory about what's going on in Norway, why people are dying. Well, it's just a theory, but uh, I think it's got something to do with climate change. You see? Well, it's just a theory. You know, I didn't work it out, really. But, you know, they have fjords in Norway. A lot of fjords. And, you know, sea level is rising. Maybe people are falling into the fjords, you know? That's what's going on. It could be. Yeah. Well, I don't know. Okay? I just know it's got nothing to do with the vaccine. Nothing. The vaccine is safe. Right. And about Norway, I was listening to this guy, Bull Hansen. I'm sure many of you know about this guy. Norwegian guy, big beard. He's sitting out there in the woods drinking coffee or something, talking to the camera. Yeah, he's brilliant. And I'm being serious now. Yeah, he's really brilliant. Yeah. And I was listening to him yesterday. And uh, he was talking about his own reaction to what's going on right now. And he said, well, basically he said, you know, he had enough. Yeah. He wants to be left in peace. I can totally relate to this. Yeah. Yeah, he had enough. That's a very good video. I will post a link below so you can check it out if you want. Right, so this guy was talking about this and... Well, for instance, he talked about earlier in his life, he had this idea about turning 50. He thought, when I turn 50, I don't want any shit in my life. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I can totally relate to this. And, of course, I started to think about my own situation. And I see, I'm going through some big, big changes during the last four months, yeah, where I uh, distance myself from certain people and connect to others. Yeah. Well, I think it's just natural. Yeah, but I, th I was thinking about it, yeah. And the people that I'm interested in, people that I want to talk to, meet, you know, become friends with, 
are the free thinkers. Those people who can express their ideas without considering what other people might think. Yeah. Now the other ones are just becoming very boring to me. You see? And I think the problem is this, uh, just this thing, that they, they seem to be fixated on being popular. Yeah? So when they have ideas, I'm sure they have ideas that sometimes are contrary to the other ones, they are afraid to express it. They suppress these ideas because they are not accepted. You see? And this makes them so boring. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, they seem to be, you know, afraid of being unpopular. And this is so important to them that they, they will not speak up. You know? And they sort of adjust themselves to the other ones. Yeah. Those people are very much boring to me. Yeah. Now I want to be around people. Yeah, I want to have friends. I want to connect to people. Yeah. And uh, yeah, so that this is what I'm doing. I'm connecting to the other ones. Whenever I see them, whenever I hear about them, I want to know them. You see. So it's free thinkers united. This was not expected, was it? I don't think so. But this is what's going on. All right, I just have to do the list today. So I'm helping YouTube with this. So these people talk about the vaccine and they disagree with the health authorities. That's basically what this is. That's the problem with these people. So I'm making this list so that you know their names. So don't search for them, don't listen to them. It's a warning, right? Uh, I have an earlier list, big one, 21 names. I'm planning to make a list video one of these days because this is so important where I will present all these names on this list, including the ones that are added every day. Every day I add a name to the list. Yeah, I'm very proud of myself helping YouTube with this. <laughs> right, that's a Swedish lady talking about side effects a lot. This is the guy from the UK. This is a celebrity. Right? They are all very strange people. This is the last one. He's a politician in Australia. Yeah. Somebody reminded me of him. Yeah. Well, he thinks he's got something to say about it. He should just shut up, this guy. Being an Australian politician, especially considering what's going on in Australia with these beautiful restrictions that you have in Australia, you should just shut up. Right. Be good.